Welcome back, everybody. Do you struggle to find matching tops and bottoms for your storage containers? Well, with the holidays just around the corner, we're really going to need as many as we can get. We certainly know that. Laura Satters is joining us in the kitchen this morning to help us get it together. This time with our food storage, Laura. Good morning. Welcome. Good morning. Thank you. Great to see you. All right. So the first up, the first uh, kind of step in this process is to play the matching game, right? Exactly. So let's talk about that. We end up having <laughs> all of those containers yeah. left over. There's no lid that fits it. There's no bottom. Yep. Go through all of those, match them up, put them together, see what extras you have. Pull them all out. Yep, pull them all out. Yep. If there's um, extra lids, they can just get recycled. If you have extra containers that either don't have a lid mm -hmm. or that they're a little bit beat Grimy. up that you probably yeah. shouldn't use them for food, right. you don't need to throw them away. You mm -hmm. can also put them um, to good use, repurposing them in yep. your office, in a desk drawer. You can use them in your bathroom drawers. We use them for battery storage too. So. Absolutely. Yep. Yep. So idea. you don't need to get rid of them. But the ones that are kind of odd I would say if there's only one of those mm -hmm. put the lid on it stack these ones that are that just have one lid yep. together and keep them with the lids that's okay. the easiest way to store those those that are one offs yeah that way we don't mix them up later um, so let's talk about how many because you really want to be careful you don't need hundreds of these right you don't need <laughs> hundreds of them so yeah. if you have three drawers mm -hmm. of Tupperware, that's probably too much in your kitchen because yeah. in a week or two weeks that you're using this storage stuff, you really don't need that much. If you're trying to keep some extra for like a holiday or to give extras away to someone, mm -hmm. then you can keep them in a different area. Maybe keep them with your turkey roaster or something yes. a little bit further away. They don't need to take up that valuable kitchen space. No, and uh, like I said, we have some cabinets in our garage. Mine are kind of shoved in there, so they're out of the kitchen. But what is the best way to store them when we're talking about actually keeping them somewhere nearby that you can grab them there's there's two things if we're not mm -hmm. stacking them up with the lids okay. the best thing I think to do is to buy ones that are the similar size you yeah. can buy a pack of several mm -hmm. so they can nest yep. this is the most space efficient maximizing thing you can do okay if it has a big lid like these snap ones just put them right in there easy in a drawer, the best thing to do is to keep those lids separate from the containers to maximize the space. Okay. What you can use is a bamboo separator. Ah. And it's a tension rod kind of mm -hmm. separator. And you can keep the lids all together and then you can keep the um, the bottoms together and see everything. Easy. And, and stack again, them up. Yeah, you can see it. It's easy to grab and go. Now, uh, you talked about dividers. They're a good option. But what is there anything else that you can recommend to keep things separate? Yeah, if you're not having a drawer, some people don't have a drawer to store theirs in, they have a cabinet. Yes. So if you have a cabinet, a great thing to use is a large container to put all the lids in, to stack them. There are even some that you can buy on Amazon. Yes. Um, I have them on my Lars list. There are different separators that you can use. It almost looks like a draining sink. And uh, we use those like for the kids' snacks too, so they're easy to find, absolutely. but use them for Tupperware lids too. Absolutely. Okay. And then the other thing is you can hang this on the back of your um, draw, uh, door. Right. So put all the lids in here so now you only have the bottoms in the drawer or door um, cabinet door right. and this is hanging on the outside easy easy stuff we uh, always need good tips for the holidays this may not be something you think about but boy could we use the extra space where can people find more on you your can, website yes okay. absolutely on my website uh, healthierspaces.com and then Laura's list has some of these ideas Laura's right? list has the bamboo separator it has these containers it has all sorts of great ideas for the kitchen and other places in your home well thanks for stopping by always appreciate it thank you absolutely stay with us everybody more good day PA coming up next